Afayele is among the several communities cut off in the Kumbungu district by the Bagri Dam spillage. It is a 10-minute walk to the community from the intake point of the Ghana Water Company Limited at Nawini. Due to the volume of water, inhabitants can only access their community in a 25 canoe ride along the river. However, a year ago, the community, farmlands and homes were destroyed by the spillage. Fishermen in Nawini have bemoaned how fishing activities have been curtailed drastically due to the destruction of fishing nets and traps by the debris carried by the spillage. Traders who do business across the river have also been affected and have some safety concerns. Because it may cost us much and sana ya kodru no one. Ya funny pa it me funny pa by say. 20 and 25. Life jacket in the one, you have 15. Yeah, jibing. This is a call, do do it. Me call, prince and crown, son, I have a number to my bed. Son, I ban the pressure and they say, bear, yeah, what this time? No, won't me train them. So I call the beer and tell them, oh, moon, you know, I'm a spread, won't me train them, sir. This is a treat, a ban normal. Yeah, but I know, and I find you never but now. Yeah, man, I'm 28 million call. But it's one you have. You're called the dada. You're coaching, you're called coach, man. The effects of the spillage also pose danger to the intake points for the Ghana Water Company Limited. In a press release by the company in Tamale, it announced a possible shutdown if the Bagri Dam spillage invades the plant at Dalong. The Public Utilities Regulatory Commission PRO for the Northern Region, Muhammad Awal, said the concerns raised by the Ghana Water Company Limited are valid, which will require customers to store up more water. Now that they are producing, a lot of people should get to this facility, store enough water that can last you for a week or two. So that should, in case the water level goes up and they have to shut down, you would have some water to take you to, through a week or two before the water will recede and before they will resume production. The only Ghana Health Service emergency canoe for patients from overseas communities seeking health care will require a lot of repairs to make it safer on the river.